Hello, good morning. Haven't charged this camera because it's been totally unplanned. Realised last night that the Royal Rumble was on last night, untraditionally not on the Sunday. I was like, what's going on? So, just watched the Royal Rumble last night and then Britt wants to go to the boot sale because I work every Sunday now, hence why I don't go to buskers or boot sales. So she wants to go to boot sales, so we're going to go to boot sales. So I'm going to quickly charge the camera, do a little bit of mobs, and uh, bear in mind that yesterday it was a full on windstorm. So, yeah, and then I've got to come home, probably have a nap. And go to work, put Ghostbusters out, and then chill. Hello from Britbo. Or is that hello? It's really... Oh, hello on the very bumpy road. Ignore the bumpy camera. Yeah, we're on our way to the boot sale. Four hours after Royal Rumble finished, so we're all very tired, aren't we? Including High Road Home. So, yeah. But no. Yeah, oh my dead. god! Oh my way! There's a tree down there, look. Oh! oh get duck under that and that tree! Oh, Jesus. I told you there was a storm last night. Bad storm yesterday. Um, so we're making sure we're careful because there may be some trees across the road. Um, but yeah, lush morning though. Absolutely lush. But yeah, we will update you. It's mega quiet. The camera's just a little bit charged, but it's mega quiet. So it's open early. Um, and when I've got to open the maze of cattle grids, watch out for that. Look at this, straight in. What, what are you going to buy a train off your granddad? Yeah. I've only actually spent 50 pence. Brit keeps spending more and more money. Yeah, everyone's talking about the weather. Camera's really fat, so, you know, we tried. Um, had to do a car trip. Even though I've only spent a pound. How much have I spent? Five. About eight or nine? One of them's an investment though, I've definitely made money back today. <laughs> you need to get that bread, stick your head in it. Look the thing. The thing. Because it's not really an unboxing. Oh, it's too dark, isn't it? Come on, one job, Stephen. Actually, 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 go outside. So, in no particular order. Look at that. I'm gonna put it on for vinyls when my vinyls are playing. Look at that. A little bit of thing. Um, I've seen this lantern, obviously I'm a big fan of Bray Wyatt, should have been in the Royal Rumble last night. And uh, I asked this woman, she had this like mirror thing that lights up, and I said, oh how much for that? Like five pounds, three pounds or something? And when I looked inside, covered in water, she gave, well, someone gave us it, got really arsy with us. So I gave up haggling the price, but then I found that. Quick, what'd you buy? Nelly! Where are you going to put that? Another Nelly. I am on my shelf I'm full of... I'm going to chew that. <laughs> On my shelf full of rhinos and elephants. Great, next bit. Nelly! Where is everything? It's in the fucking passageway. He had one job. So, a few weeks ago I bought a poster, but it's still at Brit's parents and all the way in Shields. We haven't been over. But I bought this today, £2. It's not a boy called Christmas location as well. It's the picture that came, it came with a frame. But yeah, um, so obviously the outtakes are going to be trying to frame some of it. So yeah. Talking about frames, that was the first thing I bought for a pound and at one point that's all I bought. Glass frames, again, gonna look to be framing some stuff. I have recently started The Good, The Bad and The What The Fox with Bruce Willis and it has been, so I tell you, it's been Die Hard and then I did Hostage and last night I watched The Twelve Monkeys and found this today, never seen it, never been opened and it looks like it's just one of the Paycheck Willis and Bruce Willis Blu-ray of The Assassination, so yeah, cool. Machine head burning red. Um, someone had some metal stuff. I thought it was cool that it was in a red case. Got a few machine head albums. The live album, our live album's amazing. But yeah, just shit for the car. So I was doing well. I was doing really, really well and not buying anything because Brits literally bought the biggest thing. Then I bought this. Oh, the fucking knocks. Oh. <laughs> well, I Oh, that's a bit old. I've just flicking it. You stabbed me face. Go on then, Einstein. You try it. What in there? Shift your melon out. <laughs> Go on then. Now you've got to push it hard. Go on. Mm. <laughs> See? Mr. Flat Eric has definitely made a little investment. Like I'm not gonna lie. He's yeah. in cracking condition here. He's got no holes. Tasty. Mm. 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 Is that what you think of Rinton's tea, is it? Ah, oh, yeah. 
Right, the very last thing, that very last thing, grab it and follow me, 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 grab it and follow me. Look what she bought. Look what she bought. Look what. And a mirror. Finally Am I even a, in the shop? Yeah, finally got a clock for the kitchen. Again, Titanic themed kitchen. What happens in the t 12 extra endings, it alternative still endings? Sinks. It still sinks. It's got all the different knots on it and everything though, look at it. Is it got a slip knot? I would hope so. Mm -hmm. That is definitely not going there because of. Oh no! <laughs> exactly. So the cupboard's down, I've still got to go to work, so someone's going to have to paint. <laughs> have more paint on herself than the fuck on the wall. And I come home, and there'll be paint everywhere. Don't! How awesome does that work? The vinyl stand, finally! Ding! Awesome. Wild Brit paints. Den, den, den! How awesome does that look? He's still looking for France. He's now framed up. There we go. Um, if anyone who's been following the channel for a while, most obviously I'm a massive Godzilla fan. Um, but I've had this 15, 16 years. Um, it's appeared in a lot of videos of mine. Uh, Return of Godzilla, Japanese, um, you know, as I say, coming soon movie thing. Some amazing pictures and prints. Um, it just fits perfectly. Um, and it suits well with the frame. So, yeah, one more frame left. So, in the smaller brain, the panda is back! Twist it normally, Luke is an amazing artist. And this is one of the first things I bought at the original Horicon. You might check out that video. Um, obviously, Luke did the t-shirt um, for Wasted Treads, which I wear a lot, with the guts bleeding out. There's a couple of uh, Luke stuff around, but the panda has survived so long, and I originally liked it and started talking to Luke because it's like an homage to the thing. It was a panda. So yeah, Twist it normally. Shame it's signed on the back, like, but you know. Nice frame, a nice pound frame, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I um, haven't decided what to put in the big frame yet. I put E17 poster in. It's unfortunately too small, but yeah, E17 signed. Yes, Hurricane Room, that's not even E17. Technically, it is. So, I've just got to work. Uh, well, I haven't, I've got to the car park. I'm still parking in the staff coach car park, even though loads of people who are not staff park here and cause chaos, you know what I mean? I mean, he probably doesn't work here. Why would you be coming this time of day? park right next to us um, so many trees down mental trees out there so many um, so yeah next bit of the video I'm not buying anything today for some chocolate for Brit oh. dun, dun, dun. what's out Ghostbusters nothing feels like the first time yet signed by Derek mm -hmm. Ghostbusters and doom. Here comes the storm everyone was talking about today. Mm-hmm. Machine head, Bernie Red. And I'm home. Machine Head's album's not what I remember. First track's amazing. Alright, done it, darkness. But then it's got quite sending out an SOS, so random cover. Yeah. It's actually played all the way there and all the way back and the first song's just like halfway through and I've just got home. And there's an aeroplane taking off right now. Hi, next bit of the video. It's probably gonna need another coat. So, this is still in the boot sale video. Um, if you're watching this, make sure you check out the Bloodsport and the Goonies videos that they've just both been filmed today. Up in caves and chaos in the back garden. Um, we're going for some food and then we're gonna put the clock up and that should be the end of this video. So we've walked all the way to this pub and it's as I've seven food today. So, it's up. Click, click, talk. Maybe should have done the time right before I did that. But anyway. Now who's smiling? Now who's smiling? Now who's smiling? Now who's smiling? Who's smiling? <laughs> Hello in the outtakes. I've been left this. I said, what do you do with your fish food? The fish died last year, months ago. So I'm going to feed them anyway because I sent them down here. Goodbye for now, fish. Oh dear. Oh, well, just better flush. <laughs> Well, sort of worked. I honestly do miss having a digital screen. Well, no, sorry, I miss not having the digital screen in front because I get no standees or anything now. Ghostbusters and doing her out tomorrow. No standees. But what's weird, right? This is just an outtake now. Another Anaconda box set. I've already got it. It's got a really good commentary. First one's amazing. Second one, okay. Three and four, wow. Just when you thought this video was over, the time I've cooked paint and all this, Brit's still trying to do.
do a selfie for Instagram of the war. Oh, hashtag. You can see where I've painted. Oh, hashtag. Oh, shit, hashtag. Hashtag shit. This is the end of this video. Just hashtag post it now and eat some food. I want you to go in the mirror actually and decide it. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Check this beard out. It's fucking awesome and that is all. One of them's an investment though. I've definitely written money back is it. Just need to put this in the boot sale video that's halfway edited. We're all the way back from uh, Barcelona and everything. We're looking for frames. That flat Eric's just sold for £38. How much did you buy for? £2. Fucking flipper here. <laughs>